Hey guys, welcome to Allatronics, I'm Gregory. Today I'm gonna show you in this quick video um, a circuit that I designed uh, as a challenge. I challenge myself to try to show in the XY mode on the screen of the oscilloscope digital binary digits. Let's see it working. This is an analog scope, a Tektronix in XY mode and we can see that they have here eight zeros. And I can change this. Let's see. I can show any combination of binary digits. Very nice. And this is generated in real time by this very simple circuit here. I challenge myself. And let's see how it's working. Uh, and in, it's very simple and I think you're gonna like it. So basically, my idea behind this was to generate the zeros with a quadrature oscillator. So if you have a sine and a cosine uh, in the X and Y uh, um, uh, channels, we can show that when, when the sine and cosine are in quadrature uh, or nine degrees of phase between, uh, we see on the X, Y mode a um, circle. So it's a zero. And if we uh, change the position with a staircase wave, so we have the staircase, we show the first digit, the staircase goes up, the digit comes to here, show the other digit, the star staircase goes up, show the other, the other, the other, we can show eight digits here. If you need, if you need to, to show a one, what we can do is we need to disable the quadrature signal. So here we have the quadrature and in phase signal. We, we, we show a zero, here two, a zero. And here we disable the X oscillation. The X wiggle is disabled and we show only the Y oscillation. And this appears as a one here too. Here we, we want to show a zero, we turn on the X wiggle and the Y wiggle too, and we show the zero. This is repeating its itself in a loop with uh, uh, large gate counters. So we display in real time the digits here on the scope. And you can see the, the diagram here. We have the quadrature oscillator here that, gen that generates the in phase and quadrature signal. The in-phase signal goes right to the Y uh, channel of the scope. So this signal is always going to Y, y uh, channel. And we can see it here because the, the in-phase signal is always used. We are always oscillating in Y direction to show a zero and also to show a one. The signal... Um, uh, in quadrature that we are using to we go in um, X direction we switch it, it on and off here with this MOSFET by the number we, we want to show so if you if if the input, input signal is a zero in that position we will turn on the oscillation in X direction if it's a one we're gonna disable this MOSFET they're gonna shunt the signal here and nothing uh, would go to zero to, to the X position. So uh, the signal from the quadrature is divided by four. So each digit has four oscillations in each digit. So here we go around four times and go to the next digit, go around four times, go to the next digit, go up and down four times only up and down because the X we go is disabled four times go to the next so we divided by four one of the signals in this case the quadrature signal is divided by four and here we have another counter that uh, is counting to eight in binary form and we have a ladder of resistors that generate it's like a, 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 um, a deck and it generates a staircase here. Okay, so here 
in the in the x we have a staircase that summit with the wiggle in x direction so the staircase changes the position in x direction of the digit we're gonna show and this counter also uh, select what digit we're gonna show uh, uh, turning on and off this fat here we can see in this uh, um, oscilloscope the signals let's see here we have the op amp that have the quadrature oscillators and uh, the summing output amplifier and here are the two counters uh, that we are using so we can see that we have um, let's see the, quadru the quadrature signals we have first let me probe here here we have the x signal and i can turn on the y signal here we can see we have two signals in quadrature okay so if we put these signals on the scope we would see a circle being drawn uh, in xy mode this uh, yellow signal the channel one is being uh, divided by four and after it goes to the deck to the, the other counter that generate a square um a staircase and you can see the signals are divided here and generate this output signal here 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 is nice to see this is the signals that are going to the scope and look how nice this is i think it's very nice you can see here here you can see a full sweep of the display we are let me put this yeah this is the the y signal the x signal sorry so we go to the first digit and here we're gonna show a zero so the two uh, um, signals oscillate in quadrature here you have the jump the jump to go to the next digit so the voltage jump to the next digit and here we're gonna show a zero again so we need to oscillate in quadrature the next jump is to show a one we can see here that it's gonna show a one on the scope so to show a one we need to turn off the wiggle on the x position and only oscillate the y position and this is this we can see this here is flat the signal is flat because the x wiggle is shut is is shutting down by this mosfet here we are pulling down with this mosfet so we show a one a zero again a zero again and after it we show a one a one and we jump to the start to start the next cycle cycle this is all done with analog electronics i really like it, the circuit i think it's 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 a really nice circuit uh, you put my my patreon account here on the um, the description of the of the video and there you can uh, you can download the the full schematics if you're gonna uh, try to to assemble this and this is very nice because we can uh increasing the, the the complexity a bit here with more large gates and may, may, maybe some registers we can make an old analog scope became become a logic analyzer this is an 8-bit uh, real-time logic analyzer pretty nice yeah so thank you thank you for for watching this video if you like this circuit please uh, Leave a thumb on, thumbs up on the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video.